Hey guys, what's going on? Today we're going to review the Akuma TCS Drop Shot Finesse Rod. This rod was designed by Scott Martin, Roland Martin's son. We'll go over all the specs of the rod, then I'll tell you guys what I liked and didn't like about the rod. It's a 7 foot, 2 inch, medium light, moderate fast action, and that slower tip, that slower action, is what I like the most about this rod. The line rating is 4 to 10 pound test, lure rating is 8th to a half ounce. It has a 30 ton carbon blank. It also has carbon here, right by the back foot of the reel. All the materials used for this rod were to keep the weight down. This rod weighs in at 4.5 ounces. We have a split grip, EVA foam, rubberized cork. You will also notice the threads are not exposed. So when you're holding onto the rod, you have a nice, comfortable grip. The guides are medium micro guides. They're smaller than traditional guides. A smaller guide will reduce line slap. You'll get a further cast. The frames are stainless steel. The inserts are hard aluminum oxide, which is great for braid. I'm running braid on the RTX here. That is 12 pounds Sunline SX1. This rod handles braid really well. It retails for $139.99, has a lifetime warranty. My favorite feature of the rod is the softer action. Normally on my finesse type baits, I like a faster action rod. I feel I have more control over the baits. That being said, this rod with that softer action is very sensitive and it loads and casts lighter lures really well. I mean, you can put on an eighth ounce drop shot rig with this rod and it'll load up and when it springs forward, it just launches your bait out. It's softer action paired with these medium micro guides and the longer and the longer rod, seven foot two inches, really makes for a great casting rod. I mean, it loads and casts lighter lures really well. Really impressed with the casting distance with this rod. Also with that softer tip, it'll keep fish pinned a lot better. A faster tip's gonna wanna unload on you. That softer tip stays loaded up, but if it were to unload, when you load it back up, it won't put as much stress on the hook and tear out. So. Definitely a big fan of the action of this rod. The only downside to the rod for me is the hook keeper. The hook keeper works great. I just don't care for the placement. I wish it was above the reel. But other than that, guys, it's a great rod and I've really enjoyed fishing with it. So that is my review on the Akuma TCS Drop Shot Finesse Rod. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks for watching and we'll talk to you soon.